Hey, welcome to Rotten World Entertainment, and there's a story doing the rounds that Batman, or I should say, The Batman, Part 2, and 3, are going to film back to back. Is it actually happening? Well, we do have an update, but we'll have a look at the article that said this first. So it says, The Batman 2 reportedly begins shooting next year, back to back, with The Batman 3. So here's what the article originally said before they gave it an update. So it said a few months ago, the Batman 2 was pushed back by a whole year, raising more questions about how the Elseworlds movie will fit into DC Studios. Wider plans for the DCU. While James Gunn has said out of continuity projects will continue to be made, it's still strange to think that the Batman sequel will have to compete with the Brave and the Bold, a Batman and Robin led project featuring a different Dark Knight. Still, The Batman was a hit for Warner Brothers in 2022. It earned over $770 million, and they're the ones who have the final say, not DC Studios. According to a new rumor shared by Scooper, My Time to Shine, hello, the current plan is for The Batman 2. To be shot next year with the Batman 3 immediately following. At this point, Reeves has had time to work on a third chapter and we can't imagine Warner Brothers wants there to be as big a gap between the second and third chapters as the first one and second. By the time the Batman 2 was released, four and a half years will have passed. And of course it goes on to talk about the, the Penguin series and stuff like that. However, there is an update, which says, update, James Gunn has responded and it seems we can write this particular rumor off as being incorrect. And this is what he said. James Gunn debunks a recent rumor that the Batman part two and three will be shooting back to back next year. So you have the My Time to Shine uh, tweet saying, The rumor I heard is that they will shoot the Batman Part 2 entry back to back next year. Someone responded uh, to Gunn, or at least somewhere on Twitter, or Treads or whatever the hell he's on now, and says, Is it true that the Batman Part 2 and Part 3 are shooting back to back next year? And Gunn responded directly to this person saying, It is not. Now, that being said, we know James Gunn is pretty much full of it and has a nice tendency to be lying. He constantly does. Everything he says, like, oh, it's a full reboot. Nobody from the original movies are coming forward in ours, except everyone I've worked with. <laughs> you know? So he, he does constantly say something where we can just pull up messages and tweets and previous interviews and stuff and go oh d didn't you say all of this before as well so it, you kind of have to take both sides with a grain of salt obviously it's a rumor at this point that they want to do the batman part 2 entry back to back but you also have to take james gunn with a pinch of salt because again he everything he says usually ends up being a lie even though he tries to sit there and tell you he doesn't lie and it says as well the batman 2 is scheduled to arrive in theaters on october 2nd 2026 so it's a hell of a long wait for this second movie and it, it really does seem that the penguin really uh delayed development on this movie it looks like matt reeves really just decided to go fully in the direction of concentrating solely on the penguin rather than actually working on the batman because every time you heard someone from the cast of the batman speaking getting asked like oh what's happening with the batman part two like when's it coming what's the script like what's the story gonna be and they're all like i, I haven't seen the script I've no one said anything to me about a script you know there's nothing being brought forward the only kind of news we were given was that barry kogan was actually going to be reappearing in the movie as the joker i hope not nothing against him but his joker is terrible that deleted scene that they released on youtube a couple of years ago was horrible 
absolutely hot. I know there's a lot of people who liked it. I hated it. I absolutely despise the look of that Joker. He doesn't act like the Joker. He doesn't sound like the Joker. I couldn't understand a word he said. No. And we really, in this universe with this Batman, we really don't need a Joker. I think there's a bigger, better opportunity with this version of Batman to have villains we haven't had. And of course, there is also the rumor that Clayface will be in the second one. There's a lot of speculation that Mr. Freeze will be in the second one. So we'll really have to wait and see because development on this thing seems to be really at a snail's pace. Which is so very strange. But the rumor of Batman 2 and 3 being shot back to back apparently has been debunked. Even though, again, take it a pinch of salt about it actually being done back to back. And also take a pinch of salt from James Gunn that it's not. Who knows? So, with that, I will leave it there for this one. So like, share, subscribe. Cheers, and I'll catch you in the next one.